Hey guys, welcome back. Tokyo Bowl here, and this is the last product from Celebrations. I hope you watched my, my latest video of the mini tins because it was insane. I, I really pulled the... I did not expect to pull that card. I, I will spoil it. I did not get the Charizard, but I pulled something that I really, really didn't think I would pull. So uh, if you want to watch it, uh, I will put it um, at the end of the video. But it was just a crazy video with some crazy, crazy luck. But then we get here to the end of the road with the UPC. And it was so hard to get it. I didn't get it exactly at MSRP, but it was no scalper price. So I can, I can live with that, to be honest. So... Let's take a look. I have not opened it. I just took the plastic out, which was all that I just did. And I will be taking out the rest right now. I'm going to be a tiny bit careful because I don't want to damage anything. So please bear with me for just a moment. Uh, I actually don't know how to open it. <laughs> uh, how do I open it? I don't want to break anything. Oh, there we go. So that was my moment of how how is it done? So it's kind of metallic. So I think it's just like integrated there. And then I need to just... Okay, I got it. I got it. I got it. So I need to turn it around. Okay, sorry, guys. One second for the camera angle. Yes, we got it there. I think I'm a bit close, so I might need to move there i'm gonna show it and then i'm just gonna move the rest so here what do we have so we have the it looks like the one from like the etv with the cards yeah it looks very ah no 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 okay it's not exactly the same so there you can see that it shows the the cards yeah you get like some of the promos the greninja okay so some of the cards there. So now let's take a look. Okay, this is cool. I have to say this is really, really cool. Oh, okay. I will take them very carefully. And we will take a look after. Because, uh, well, at the end of the day, those are the most expensive cards from the box. So... I don't want to damage them at all because I want them in my collection and I want to keep them in the best condition possible. So the other packs, they're there. Uh, the code for the UPC. And then here we go with the two cards here. So there we go. We put them on the side and then we get the packs. Should be 17 packs. Well, it is awesome. It looks absolutely awesome. And I can understand why it's called Premium Collection because it is built spectacularly, really. But I will move it because otherwise we're not going to have enough space. Sorry for the... that. Is, that is how we continue. One second here. Okay, so let's take a look at the cards. So I'm not sure I'm going to open them right now. So I'm going to keep them with this sleeve for the moment. Just going to move there a tiny bit. Yeah, perfect. But they don't look bad. Let's look at the centering. Okay, no. The centering is not... You can Hopefully you can see that the top border is smaller than the lower one so the center is centering is not perfect let's take a look at the next one. Oh, let's see yeah so kind of the same and it has a tiny bit of white i'm not sure you can see it but it's a tiny bit so it's not that noticeable but it has a tiny bit of white so let's get to the cards this one i'm even nervous to just open them because i don't want to make cause any damage to them so I'm kind of nervous so if you see me shaking they're not 
chipped. I have seen a lot of them that are chipped. They're not chipped. They are in actually excellent condition. The charitor is really in a good condition. Sorry guys if I don't talk that much, but I'm just trying to focus on them. They're in excellent condition. Okay. I don't know yet what I'm going to do, but I'm going to put it on the table with a top sleeve on the bottom and then figure out what to do with it. And then let's look at the Pikachu. Let's look at the Pikachu. They are heavy. They're less heavy than I expected. That is my first impression regarding the weight. Let's look at the bag. Ah, oh, this one has the white. But I think, ah, no, 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 it's just dirt. It's just dirt. Okay. Again, not chipped. Looks in a really good condition. I'm extremely happy at the moment. So I'm going to do the same. I'm just going to put it like that. So it's not, and I'm going to leave it on the side. And then I need to figure out exactly what to do with them. But they look great. They look absolutely great. So that is good. I was really worried that, you know, because of the boxes, they move so much and they just can get damaged. So that is awesome. That is really, really awesome. And this pin is one of the things I really, really wanted. I know I can buy it for like 10 bucks, so it's not an issue of money, but it looks so good. This is like one of the additions that I wanted to have. So this one is really cool. So let's get to the packs. I'm going to start with... ah. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I forgot about the coin. So this is like, it looks similar to the celebration ones, the other ones that you get from the tins and all the other products, but this is heavier. It is heavier and it's not, it's not kind of like the plastic. I have it here, I can show it. Well, this one is plastic and this one is some kind of uh, light metal. So not, I'm not gonna say it's like something really heavy, but you can see that it's better quality. And then we have uh, three chilling rain. We have, uh, oh, this one is on the other side. We have, I don't understand. We have three vivid voltage, battle styles, and darkness ablaze. I'm going to start with battle style, darkness ablaze, and then I get to the other two. So I am just excited. I don't know, you guys. I For me, it was so hard to get the UPC. I know they're still being released. So if you haven't managed to get one yet, you can still have because there are different waves for the UPC. So try not to pay like scalper prices because I don't think there's a need. So they are out there. Pokemon really produce a lot. So maybe they're more expensive than MSRP, but don't pay like 300 bucks or something like that. Should not be the price. Goldbat, the Single Strike Style Mustard, the Stupa, the Scatterberg, the Cubone, the Morcro, the Tepic, the Honage, the Gligar, and the Trampa. Let's go with Darkness of Blaze. So we have the code there. One, two, three. Energy. Okay, so we have the Heat Energy, the Simi Zero, the Dark Trio, the Rollet, the Wishy Washy, the Coffant, the Sinisty, the Fibas, the Nikit, and the Zarina. So nothing, now uh, no hit at the moment. Then we go with Vivid Voltage. And I want to close with Chilling Rain. I love Chilling Rain. I absolutely love Chilling Rain, but the pools are bad. I opened the a booster box the other day and I didn't get any secret rare, which had not happened before for me. I know you're not guaranteed, but it was... I was not, I was a tiny bit disappointed, but I got one of my chase cards. The Sepstrika, the Eevee, the Seedot, the Electric, the Clefairy, the Fumpy. Oh, I like this one, the Flareon, the Reverse Holo. And then we got the Yan Mega. This one, I like it. I like the Reverse Holo of the Evolutions. Evolutions, not Evolutions. They're cool and they really go... The design of the card it really goes with the, the the style. So we have one, two, three. What do we have? So we have oh stone energy, the electric, the kakuna, the joltic, the sundial, the sidot, 
de Piquipec, de Mudbray, de Mayena, and then a Mudsdale. So no hits so far. I'll move this to the side, so we're trying to be a tiny bit more organized. But you guys should really see how my, like, the mountain of, I would call it, disaster looks after the videos because it's just absolutely crazy. I, I have, when I open the packs, I really just concentrate on that. And then I'm like, okay, I just throw it away on the sides and I deal with it afterwards. So we have the Girafaric Electric. Ah, what is wrong with these cards? Electric, the Delmis, the Clobopus, the Eevee, the Execute, the Electric, the Whittle, the Sepstruka Rubber's Hollow, and a Sechrom as our Hollow Rare. I'll put it there. So, Chilling Rain, can you bring us some luck? At the end of the day, Celebrations Pack, I'm the ones that I'm looking for. I'm looking for the Charizard, so... I am okay with whatever I get here. I'm not, the objective for me are really not the additional packs that come with the, the Ultra Premium Collection, to be honest. For that, I'm just happy to open a booster box or something like that. It is really no problem. Uh, so we have the Hatram, the Clobopus, the Marip, the Ralt, the Class Form, oh, the Snover, the Seviper, and then the Chrysalia as our holo rare. So we have two more packs. For this one, I actually am really happy. I got in one of the evolutions team. I got um, I got ah, uh, what did I get? I got the um, oh, I forgot the name. One of the Calyrex, the Ice Rider, the the V Max, the oh, the V Max alternate art. So I think that was one of my best hits of 2021. The Clara, the Broly, the Hunter, the Widow, the Galarian Farfetch, the Sobble, the Ladyba, the Scobet, the Sphil. No way! We got a secret rare! We got a Tornadus VMAX Rainbow Rare. Okay, that... So I open a booster box and I cannot get a secret rare and I open three packs and I get a secret rare. I, I, I don't understand the pulls, really. It's just absolutely strange. It's absolutely strange. What can I say? Okay, we got a secret rare. Oh, it's a bit of glaring, so maybe I'll just put it here on the side. But seriously, like, what is happening? So I cannot get a secret rare out of that, but I can get it from there. That is just crazy. Okay, last pack. Could you imagine that we get a second? I, I would be just... I, I would scream, like, I would die here. Okay, one, two, three. We take out the energy, and then we have the... Oh, what is wrong with this? Why is it not... Ah, uh, oh, there. The... Oh, the Ladian, the Clara, the Welcoming Lantern, the Galarian Yamask, the Coughing, the Chopette, the Scobet, the Sphil, the Scobet, and a Weevil. So this was our best pull, which is a good card. I will add it to... I'm trying to do the Master Set. It's going to be extremely hard, but that was a good, uh, a good pull. So now we have the 17 packs of Celebrations. So what is happening? Why is it not... Uh... Wait, guys. Let's see. For some reason, it's not focusing okay we continue had to cut it for one second as for some reason the video was just not focusing but that is no problem then we get to the celebrations pack so we have 17 packs to open and our bounty card is the charizard so what do we have so we have the grudon the cernius nice we got a mew we got a mew that is a nice card I got already, this is my second one in English, and I actually already got one in Japanese, so that is really cool. So we got the Mew there. Let's see what we get. Uh, yeah, to be honest, I'm, I'm, I'm just happy with the celebrations. Um, 
I was a bit disappointed about the pull rates at the beginning when I started to open in celebrations, but it has really grown on me. I, I, I should have just trusted how much I was going to enjoy it. So we have the Cosmog, the Iveltal, the Dialga, and a Pikachu. You can never go wrong with a Pikachu. You know, this the uh, design of the original, yeah, we could say kind of original Pikachu. It's, uh, I think it's just iconic. It's one of like those really that you see them and you know ah okay that is kind of like one of the original designs so i think it just brings kind of like memories okay so we have the Iveltal, the cosmog ah a clydo that is good but okay i have like 10 clydos so i there are cards that the pull rates should not be as high but i have so many of them and the uh, cards that in theory i should be pulling and uh, they're impossible. I'm not talking about the Charizard, by the way. I'm just talking about some other cards that the pull rate should not be that bad, but I'm not really able to, to get them. So the code. So we get the Lugia, the Cernias. I don't have the Magikarp. I don't, I don't think, I don't think I have the Magikarp. Oh, we got a shiny Magikarp. We got a Shining Magikarp. What, was it this one, the one that it took hours to get from uh, Pokerep? I think it was the Shining Magikarp. Well, I pulled a Magikarp. So I want the Charizard, but the Magikarp? <laughs> I remember the Magikarp from the, from the original set. And uh, I know now it's quite expensive, of course, because it's a kind of old card, but it was not really particularly sought out at that time when, when the set came out. Uh, the Zamazenta, and then we have the code. Okay, let's continue. Uh, what was I talking about? Yeah, so the magic card. So, you know, sometimes I'm surprised because there are cards that when the original set came out, they were just like the most normal cards in the world. And then through the years, because some of them were kept better, then cards that you may have not might have not expected that go significantly up in value, they do. Uh, the Sekrom and the Mew. But I, I mentioned it before, like celebrations, it is a, it is a, a nice set, but it was really printed out. And I think people like at the time this set came out, a lot of people were on the mentality of I want to collect my cards in the best condition. So this one really is not for playing. So another cleffer. <laughs> another cleffer. Oh, I have so many cleffers. Um, so they just basically are grading the celebration sets as much as they can. So there are going to be so many of each card. And I'm not talking about like low, like eight or, or nine. I'm talking about tens. I, I saw like the PSA, um, they posted an Instagram, PSA, yeah, PSA, they posted, a, they did a post in on Instagram, like showing which were the most um, graded cards for like December or November, and the cherries are, I think, was top three, so, no, no way, I got another call the Mew, no way, no way, no way, okay, don't move, don't move, don't move, we're gonna sleep it. We're going to sleep it. We're going to sleep it. We're going to take a look. A tiny bit, the border, the bottom one is bigger. But I pulled another golden Mew. I pulled another one. Oh, la la. I got another golden Mew. I did not expect another golden Mew. I did not expect it. Oh, that is... Uh, that is lucky. That is lucky. I'm uh, a bit uh, surprised because if you look my the t the the video with the mini tins, I pulled another card that did not did not expect to pull. So I'm just uh, yeah I'm surprised to say the least. Let's say surprised, but I'm 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 way more than surprised. I'm just I did not expect it. Okay, let's look at the code. So we got the Palkia, the Grudon. The Gardevoir. I don't have the Gardevoir in English. I don't have it. I don't have it. All these openings today are... I'm, I'm, I recorded this morning the the Minitins video, so 
I'm recording two today. Today is just insane. I, I don't think I, I remember a time, no. The only time that I had such insane pulls was when I opened the three Evolution Stins, the Flareon, Vaporeon, and the Jolteon Stins that came out not so long ago. Those were like my best pulls ever. But uh, this is coming to a close second. The Cosmoem, the Dialga, the Kyogre, and the Surfing Pikachu. The Surfing Pikachu. You know, I like the 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 designs of the, the Surfing Pikachu and the Flying Pikachu. They are cool and they are kind of like VMAX form. It's also really cool. Okay, I'm having some troubles with this pack. No problem. So we have the Palkia, the Reshiram, the Cosmog, and the Surfing Pikachu VMAX. So we have one after the other. So this one was the one I was talking about. Look at this big boy, like the chunky boy there. And we have the code. Then we have, how much do we have left? How many? So we have six left, so. I'm still hoping that the Charizard is coming, but wow, that golden meal is just insane. Was insane. So we have the Grudon, the Cosmog, the Palkia and the Professor's Research. We have five more, five more. Can we get that Charizard? You know, if I don't get the Charizard, I mean, I am okay with that. I, but I, I don't think I will purchase it. I said if I pull it, I will have it, but I don't think I will purchase it. It's, I don't think if it's not in the cards to get it, then it was not in the cards. Another professor's research. You know, sometimes I really believe like in the luck of the things that you get, or in this case, the cards that you get, and it was not meant to be. I was meant to have two golden meal, an Umbrian, but not a, a Charizard. So let's go. So we have the Palkia. The, oh, I didn't have this one. I didn't have the Mew 2 EX. I didn't have this one. I, 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 today I seem to be just feeling my set. I really am. I really am. I'm like, I, I have so many. There are a lot of cards that I was missing from the set. And I seem to be just getting them today. But not the Charizard. <laughs> okay, let's put it here. This one deserves a top loader. Oh. I am shaking a bit. I, I The pulls that I have been getting are just crazy. I, they're crazy. They're absolutely crazy. And if you can see, I think you can see it on the camera, the mess that I have on the car, with the cards. They're really... I'm, I'm a mess when I open. I should be more tidy, but... I get so excited when I'm opening that I just forget. Like also like the the packs of the oh I saw that one. The packs of the booster packs are really like just lying around everywhere. Another Clefa. I think this one is like eighth. I, I lost track of how many Clefas I got. Okay, we have the Clefa there. Two last packs. Two last packs. Okay. I'm just, oh, I'm, I'm lost for words. I'm literally lost for words, like lost what to say. I'm so excited about the pulls that I get today. Like, oh, they're so good. Okay, so we get the Grudon, the Solgaleo, and then the last pack. Oh, let's see, let's see. Charizard, you are here. You must be here. You must be here. Let's see what we get. Let's see what we get. Can you imagine if I, it's really here? I don't think so. Sorry, guys. That is my expectation, but would be absolutely amazing. So what do we have here? So no hit on the last pack. Should we take a look what we got today? Like the big hits. So we got the Tornadoes Max, the Rainbow Rare. We got the Mewtwo. We got the Claydol. We got the Shining Magikarp. The Cleffa. Another Cleffa. We got the Mewtwo. Oh, this one was... I didn't have it in English or Japanese, so I'm really happy. We have the Gardevoir EX. And then we have the Mew. The Golden Mew. So I can get a Golden Mew. I can get a Umbreon, but no Charizard. <laughs> 
Well, that is the luck that we get. I am no way unhappy because that Mew, look at that Mew. Look at that Mew. You know, the first one I pulled, I actually, I think I opened it like on the first day, I opened Celebrations and I didn't know that it was so rare. So I was like, oh, cool, a Mew. But now it's like the Mew, it's the Mew. Thank you guys. Thank you so much for joining me today through this journey. And if you like, please hit me with a like, drop me a comment. What has been your, what would I say, your happy moments with celebrations? And you can also tell me what has been your bad moments with celebrations. And if you enjoy, please consider subscribing. And bye-bye.